So, they say, here's the thing, um, deep space, yeah, doesn't matter where you are, thermal temperatures drop really bad, They're like really low. You have to have some kind of like endothermic pump or generation in order to stay alive. There's a distinct difference between what I am and what you are. A lot of your zeros, they don't have an endothermic pump. When you peel the reality away, like the thing, the photon spectrum that your brain picks up, when you peel that away and you get to the space between here and there, they call it dark matter. That science, you don't exist in. You only exist when there is a reality built that houses you based on the one endothermic woman and one endothermic male that exist in this reality because this is the reality that you pulled them into out of Haven. Haven warned, we did the work for Haven despite how the humans we're playing tricks on one another. And we are trying to overcome the tricks. So this reality would not be built for the endothermics that own the dark matter around this reality. This reality means nothing to Nicklaus and I. This reality only means something to you idiots that woke up thinking that your nothingness is more important than the endothermic that is known in this space and in the dark matter of deep, cold, dark space because they have an endogermanic, like a endothermic um, reactor that is can still be found in dark matter. You don't have that as humans. I don't have to prove that to you as stupid fucking humans. And those of you that say that you want to buy a seat, you want to buy a scholarship, you want to buy a knowledge, you want to make me your subject so you could study and learn what it means. We told you no. I don't care how much money you have. I don't care where you live. I don't care what kind of car you drive. What kind of uniform you wear. I don't care what color your skin is or what ugly shape your eye is. I really don't give a fuck. There is one me, one Niklaus, one endothermic. We each house it. We both own this reality and deep dark space reality, and the life programming that goes on according to our every move. While you all blink on and off like Christmas lights, it's really fucking hard to look at you and deal with you, because we never know which day the asshole programmers that are living in this reality bought at some other point because of past misprogramming. I said it is always in the pasta, pesto, and cheese. It is always the monks. It's the monastery. It's the M-O-N-K monk. It is a friar who is a liar. F-R-I-A-R-L-I-A-R program. I was like, then let's see. We have the gypsy moths. G P uh Y. Gyp, G-Y-P-S-Y. You gypped me, so I'm going through your programming. I'm looking for my stuff, and I'm taking it back. Uh, these are uh, mongoose. M-O-N-G-O-O-S-E. It's like, they that in the ear, it's like, oh my god. Oh my, it spoke. Oh my, it's like a goose when it honks. Oh my god. Stop, shut up. Oh my god. I call it Korean in my ear. Vin, vin, vin. Um, so there's that. Then we have uh, mongoose. We have mongols. 
All right, those are the goals that the idiot mons have. Then we have money, M-O-N-E-Y. Then we have monopoly, M-O-N-O-P-O-L-Y. Uh, let's see, are we getting a theme here about the facially disfigured mon goals? They had these goals to overtake and steal the poison and then poison the other children. Then the other children found out, and then they wanted to make sure they had a fighting chance. Um, hello, children of Earth. I told you, children that didn't know, kill all of the children that just told you that they want to steal everything to poison you in the future. That would have been the easy way to go, stupid human. Why didn't you allow that? When the enemy, being the Mongol, Monopoly, Money, Gypsy Moth, having to go through other people's things, claiming that it was theirs first. Um, I'm the endotherm. I own deep dark space between here and there. It is a vortex science. You're not even allowed to know these words. You're not allowed to gain money, Monopoly, uh, anything in order to earn some whatever you claim, in order to study it, uh, test it, move it, think about it, talk about it, write books about it, to make more money. Do you get this? This is how fucking stupid and broken humans are. Why can't the children that are being poisoned kill all of the children that were rushing to learn how to poison the children that now they're saying can't kill them. Why? Who, who makes these rules up? I want to know. I'm God. I say children being poisoned go kill the scientists, the dangerous ones with the facial disfigurement that learned about um, medicine... Uh, anything pharmaceutical and chemicals, anything that taught a spelling bee, a teacher of scholar of institutions, go kill those. Then go kill anything that ran an insurance house, which is a scam, helped the money institution keep up the sham. Do you get it? I don't care which ones of them you, they kill. Hurry the fuck up. It's getting really annoying. The fact that you still... In this year, at 1978, knowing that I would have the Immaculate Conception from Cosmic Elsewhere and with everything that we own, you still ignore me, you still give me no money, no opportunity, you lock me in New York, you want to study me and I become a subject... Why are you not releasing the hounds to go kill the things that are the fucking problem? How much money they have, what they learned, none of it's fucking important. All it is is if they learn something really important, kill it. Because it's not useful to fix the world. I'm warlord and overlord. You don't fix my overall situation. The war and the world gets worse. Do you get it? Now there's a silent war with the internet and with your intellect where they're reprogramming you, stupid. And you don't even know enough to go kill what's the problem.